Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Alien Isolation. We've got the trauma kit now for Taylor and we're on our way back, but we've got a little bit of a problem with the elevator not working, so we're going to have to try and fix this or find an alternate route. We've just jumped down from an air vent somewhere, heard that one over there, and now we've got people, um, humans actually, stalking around looking for the alien it seems. I'll tell you what guys, when I'm done playing this game, I'm going to be so good at hide and seek. <laughs> Alright, so how, how many have we got? We can um, bring this up, can't we? We've got at least one on the left. So there's three over there near the right hand side. Looks like there's quite a lot there, so we're going to go through this vent and hopefully get around them a bit, a bit easier. Alright, let's check down this side. Oh, there's not there. Alright, let's go this way. This is going to bring us out um, to the side of these guys. We have got a revolver now as well, so hopefully one shot headshot with these with this should kill them if we need to use it. But we're gonna go for the stealth approach before first. Mahoney, thank God. We got jumped. Looters. We're trapped. Elevators out. We don't know where to look. Is he insane? Peterson wants to know if you're fucking insane. Those things have started attacking people. They're friendly unless you do something unauthorized. Talking to an android in the warehouse is fine. It'll know how to fix the elevator. Okay, Francis out. Asshole. Should be fine. Well, I'm sure as hell not making new best friends with one of those things. It seems like these guys, and they're not looters because they said they got jumped by looters. So these might be friendly if I approach them. I really don't know. I'm not gonna just pop my head out and say, hey guys, wanna, wanna have a tea and cupcakes? So we are gonna stealth around them a little bit, I think. What is the quest right here? Find the compression cylinder to repair the elevator. I don't think these guys are gonna be that helpful. Station feels like a graveyard, huh? Let's open this. This is gonna take us backwards. See, I'd like to think that they would be friendlies. But you really don't know until um, you encounter them. Alright, this is like a long game um, system here, so we're going to go around this side. and It's actually going to take us deeper into the room, if we go right here. And keep going straight. Here we go. So, what do we do now? Hold on, let me think. What did you think that noise was we heard earlier? Sounded like an explosion. I figured that out, genius. I mean, what caused it? Gotta be weights. I heard he's trying to kill that creature by setting traps. Remote charges, can you believe that? He's gotta be crazy. Maybe that's the answer. I heard that Waits has some kind of safe haven up near the Galleria. We could go there. Did you not hear what I said? Crazy fuckers blowing stuff up. No thanks. We're running out of options. Then shut up and let me think. Okay guys, found an exit in the ventilation system on the left hand side of where we went in. So we can open this and see where it leads us. Hopefully we're not in front, of, in front of some guys. Oh god, there's a guy right there. These do not look like friendlies because, you know, they got guns out. We can get through this. I don't even know where I'm heading right here. Okay, there is also like no indication of where to go on the map. So we've got to figure this out for ourselves here. To find the cylinder we need to use on the elevator. What's this? Why is there a dead guy here? Right, there's no one over here. I think we can update the map with this, can't we? Whenever you see this thing on the wall, the white light, you can normally update the map if you click on it. So we've got a computer. So it's going to give us anything useful. Okay, so not operation not permitted. Um, WYR years ahead, just talking about the competition. Your report, blah de blah, blah, error, file corrupted. Yeah, there's nothing on there really. Just a few emails and nothing that can really help us. I wonder if it's a way of taking these guys out. I think there's a guy on the other side of this wall now. I oh, know he must be below. Okay, so we're on the high ground. We've got like an advantage looking down at these 
they're like engineers, these guys, aren't they? Not really losers, so I don't know if they are a threat. <laughs> There's a save point in here, so that's a good sign. I think we should probably use this. Okay, we've saved, and now we've got a computer in this room as well. Another access terminal. Let's check this out. So, working Joe Spiel. Not really. Just talking about the working Joes. Storage inventory. Shared error. 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 A lot of errors. So the computers are all. Like, got viruses or something. Actually, we, all, we updated the map earlier, didn't we? Is there anything on here now that's useful? There is a marker there showing us something of interest. I think it's this blueprint on the wall, smoke bomb. There we go. Right, this leads downwards now, downstairs. So we're just going to move forward. Until we bump into something that could be a mission objective. There's a door over there we can access. Shit. Okay, so here's the alien. He's killing those guys. Alright, there's a door on this side. Pump in. Right, let's move forward a bit. Just get out of that room where the alien was. <laughs> Play a little bit of hide and seek. Some revolver ammo, that tells me I'm going to have to shoot something soon <laughs> if it's given to me. So, I don't think we're actually looking for anything on the terminal, but I'm just... You might find something useful in here, whether it be like opening a door, a passcode, to get beyond where we need to go. So, it's not... Like, anything that like, stands out as blue writing or anything that's a utility, that's normally when you need to look at it and find something useful. Seeing as it's just all... Junk. We can ignore that. Alright, we can go upstairs there. Okay, find a way to open the door to the warehouse. Is that the warehouse door? Component storage. Yeah, storage is warehouse shit. Right? So we need to find a way to enter there. Oh dear. Is it average Joe? Oh, and the aliens in the vents. Oh, use the quick requisition Android to access the computer. Yeah. So we're going to have to use Android to unlock the door, it seems. So maybe... We click on that button over there. Yeah, that's pointing me in that direction. So let's click on this and then we'll have to move backwards so the average Joe doesn't actually spot us before we restore power. Okay. So before we do that, find a way to power up the requisitions Android. Now uh, it's back this way. It's gonna be probably up the ladder, I think. Let's just see where this leads us. Yeah, the ladder for sure. So let's climb up the ladder. The alien is in the vents, but <laughs> we haven't seen it yet, this video, so um, I'm hoping he stays where he is. So it's this way. Let's save the game, why not, because we've made a little bit of progress in going in the right direction. Okay guys, the map is just, uh, the objective is just updated when we step in this room. So, you would think that we have look, we should be looking at something in here to tell us where the, where to power up the, um, the thing. You know, the, the, the average Joe station. Now, it doesn't really tell me much by looking around in this room. We've got this map looking thing, but it looks like a railway track. Okay, gas is the red, electric is brown. Yeah, that doesn't really help me. Is that meant to be... Uh, yeah, let's just go, guys. Just wasting too much time looking at that, trying to figure out what the hell it means. So we're going to jump down here. Because the objective now tells me to go downstairs. And go back in the room. So you think that be buying, taking us up into that room first, and then bringing us back down. We should have learned something by going up there. But I didn't really learn anything. <laughs> so we still need to restore the power. And why the aliens not here? We can move around a bit quicker. Yeah. So the power needs to be restored. And we'll look around. What are these? They're just like um, they move the things up and down. I guess the platform, so we can access different. Um, you know, freezing things, whatever they are. So it's in here somewhere. Maybe it's in the next room. There is a save point here, so we may as well use this because there's no enemies about. The saves is going back upstairs. There's a lot of save points in this area. We found like three within like a few rooms of each other. Normally the miles away. 
So, we'll search this guy's body. He's got some stuff on him. We're all maxed out, so. Use. Security access tuner upgraded. So, we can now. There we go. So, there was a room upstairs that we could access now, I guess, because it said we didn't have the right device. And this time, we can actually access this computer, this terminal. And the alien's gonna come down any minute now, isn't he? You just know he's gonna come down through that window as we finish doing this. That's just a, a given. So let's do this. Now watch this window. Okay, so the power's activated. See that, that average drone out in that booth? We can now go down to him. Save it quickly. Yeah, so I was saying we can now go down to that average Joe and open him up and he's gonna actually give us access to the storage which is that one there I don't know maybe he's just gonna wander around free roaming and he'll eventually want to go in here to just check up and we've got to follow him in I guess so we're gonna turn this on let the guy out excuse me and then um, we'll we'll hide and have to follow him so actually I'm gonna go into the um, the air vent over here Actually, wait there. If we're trespassing, are we trespassing right here? Is he going to attack us? Let's just stand here a second. See what he does. If we can. Oh, there we go. So he's friendly. I need a compression cylinder. Components warehouse. Row one, stack B. Follow me. Just keep the noise down, okay? So, because we're not in a trespassing zone, the average Joes will not attack you. They are willing to help humans that are, have authority access to where, where they are stationed. But I don't know why they're programmed to like kill you if you're trespassing. It must be a malfunction. Surely they're not meant to be that way. So this guy's going to open the door for us. And now we can get the cylinder thing we need to open the, um, the elevator and access it. So the something's telling me your compression cylinder will be found at the far end of this row. The far end of this row. That, that, it's gonna die on that, isn't he? That's electricity. You're gonna die, mate. Yep. Whoa. Yep. I'm not going that way. I'm gonna go in the, in the event, and hopefully that's gonna take me out to the other side. And it doesn't. It's blocked off. So Fantastic. And there's nothing in here at all. Maybe this is like a hiding spot. The alien's definitely going to come in here now if there's a hiding spot there. So we're going to have to go around the other side, maybe. Maybe that will not be wet with electricity. I think we're going to have to um, move this down. Yeah, that's not really helping, is it? Oh, wait there. You can look at each, each button up and down. I didn't realise. So we're going to move this down all the way. And then we're going to look at our options. See what we've got. So this has moved down now all the way. We can get around. Here we go. We can just walk around the platform now. Where there's no electricity. And now... What we're looking for should be... It's on the far row, right? So it should be here. Is it on this? So it's on this one, right? So if we move this, let's move it up one. And then if we, if it's not that one, we can, yeah, it's locked now, so we can go down all the way until we find. What is this? Like, how do you access this? Oh, there's little buttons on there. What was that noise? Sort of made a clicking noise. There we go. Every single, every single shelf is empty apart from this one. Place components in the elevator. So all that just to get that. Good job, there's only one thing left in the whole storage system, and it's that thing we need. So, we haven't seen the alien for a while, so he's really due to appear any moment. Okay. So we're heading back out the way we came in.
Okay, the la alien was last seen here, where he killed all those people. And I think we're going to head back to where we came from. The way we came, actually. We went upstairs. So we, we are going back to where we started, right? Yeah, that's... I'm going to take this route just because I know it. And I don't really... I'm not familiar with what's going on downstairs. There is no um, markers showing the movements of the alien, which is very strange. They normally just push it in your face constantly. But he seems to not even be in the area right here. So there should be a ladder in that corner, yes. Here we go. Look at them navigation skills. So we're going to climb down. I'm just taking the safe route here to get back. I'll say a route that I know is quite concealed. So we're going to jump back down here. Even though the alien's presence is not really there, it might, might appear at any moment. So we go through this vent. We should stick to the right hand side, take this right here, and this will bring us up behind a few boxes, back up where we were. I'm probably taking the extra long route here, that is not necessary, but in this game you get you can get shit on so quick, instantly. I just want to be safe. So open this, and now we can climb out. We should be okay, actually, to just walk through the middle. I mean, there is nothing here, literally. I could have probably just done all that walking through the middle, but I just didn't feel safe when you heard an alien there, like, a few minutes ago, and it, people screaming and getting murdered. So let's save before we put the cylinder in. Alright, guys, I'm going to actually end the video right here, because um, we've got a save point right here. We've, we've achieved a few objectives by getting the cylinder, and we should be able to put this in now. And in the next video, we'll, um, hopefully... Make all those noises being made. We'll hopefully get to um, Taylor and he heal her with the trauma kit that we found. So thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next video. Bye.